All right, guys, today we're going to talk a little bit about Shattered Unit Dreams. Now, this is just the comparison video here, and we're going to take a look at how the default Unit Dreams look in comparison to Shattered Unit Dreams. So here we are. I've got my Arena Frames in the usual spot and my Party Frames at the bottom of the screen. And as you can see, you know, uh, it's pretty simple. You can't really see that much. So we can see the Caspers on the Arena Frames, but we can't really see the buffs or the debuffs. Furthermore, for example, you can't see the... Uh, uh, buffs and debuffs more than four of them. You can't see more than four at the same time. So when my uh, druid buddy had, uh, you know, vampiric touch on him, it didn't actually show that on my raid frames. Uh, another thing you can't see is you can't track uh, all the buffs you've got on the uh, target. So for example, I can see that I've got a life bloom, but you know, just there when he used his Tiger's Fury, you know, if I had a Life Bloom on him, I wouldn't have been able to see it at all because, you know, the uh, default unit frames are very limited in that sense. So right here we're taking a look at the shattered unit frames, and things are in very similar positions against my, except my arena frames are at the top. And as you can see, I can see buffs and debuffs on the arena frames. Now that is very, very powerful. Furthermore, I can see more than uh, three buffs and debuffs at the same time, and I'm also filtering out, uh, you know, buffs and debuffs. So the priest, I can only see the important buffs on the priest here. It makes uh, the spelling, target switching, and anything else very easy. Furthermore, let's take a look at some features such as uh, uh, aura indicators. So for example, if the druid were to get feared very soon, as he'll get feared, I'll be able to see a huge, huge fear icon over him. So take a look. There you go. Not only do we see the debuffs, but we also see a huge fear icon. It makes the spelling very easy. And of course, this can be configured to anything else. Not only fear. And here I get hexed. And as you can see, I see the huge hex icon over my uh, read frames at the bottom left. Uh, you can also keep track of, uh, of course, more buffs at the same time than three, and you can keep track of debuffs, so it's very easy to get lost. For example, in Arena, you might have just heroism debuff and you know a couple of other trash debuffs, and you just won't even know what's going on. And uh, keep in mind, you know, that all of this is very customizable. You can change the settings as much as you want. But the most important part here are the Arena buffs and debuffs. And of course, uh, you can also enable the uh, arena casting bars icons and icons everywhere so definitely that's something that's turned on and off easily.